to Mama Fox Books Storytime Saturdays. Today we're going to be reading my book called Baby's Bond. Baby's Bond is a companion book to Baby's Nurse and was also illustrated by Jim Fox. Baby's Bond is written in haiku poetry. A haiku poem is made up of 17 syllables. It's written in three lines with five syllables in line one seven in line two, and five in line three. I hope that you'll take the opportunity to write your own haiku poem after you listen to Baby's Bond. Baby's Bond, written by Phoebe Fox, illustrated by Jim Fox. This book is dedicated to all mothers and babies in honor of the sacred bond they share. And Jim Fox dedicated it to his five grandchildren. He says, I cherish them more than words can describe. Cherished from the start, babies held in loving arms, precious bond begins. Sneaking from their pouch, joeys cling to mama's back, lessons on the go. Did you know a mama possum can have as many as 20 babies? And they're all born in her pouch because she's what we call a marsupial. Rocked by gentle tide, baby calf gulps pearly milk. Flippers stroke the sea. Do you know what kind of animal that is? Those are manatees. And the manatee baby can nurse underwater from its mother's flipper pit. Born of silky fleece, Kriya feeds, then sweetly hums. Peaceful highland home. A Kriya is a baby alpaca, and alpacas love to hum. Bobbing up and down, Hungry hippo guzzles milk. Underwater lunch. Did you know a baby hippo, when it's born, can weigh as much as a hundred pounds? Landing on lush grass, wobbly calf stands up to nurse. Long legs lengthening. A baby giraffe can be up to six feet tall when it's newborn. Frightened on the move, Joey takes a head first dive back to pocket womb. So the Joey is another type of marsupial baby and it nurses from its mother's pouch. And when the mama needs to call its baby, she uses a clicking sound. Roused by mama's touch, little calf drinks creamy milk, guarded by the herd. This is a bison mama and baby. The bison is the national mammal of the United States. Feeling each warm breath, Joey cuddles fuzzy fur, soothing treetop hug. Do you see how the koala is hugging its mama? And he's reaching into that pouch. Koalas are also marsupials. So mothers have pouches where their babies are born and carried and nursed. Under white peaked waves, Baby Blue swims steadily, gentle water waltz. The blue whales look like they're dancing in the water. Squealing side by side, pale pink piglets suckle milk, rich, pure, delightful. Sometimes you'll see piggies wallowing in the mud and that's because pigs cannot sweat. So they roll in the mud to keep cool. In dry desert home, Camel calf must quench her thirst, safe from scorching sun. The hump on a camel's back contains fat, and that fat provides energy for the camel when it needs it. That hump can weigh up to 80 pounds. Hidden in the trees, baby sloth sips sleepily, destined for a nap. The three-toed sloth is one of the slowest moving mammals on earth. It's so slow that algae grows on the grooves between its hairs, and that helps the sloth blend into its surroundings. Settled heart to heart, baby chimp and mama snooze. Liquid lullaby. A baby chimp may nurse from its mother for up to five years, and it usually stays close by its mother for a couple more years after that. Grasping silver fur, baby's nurse beneath the moon peckish pair of pups. Wolf pups will nurse from two to four weeks and then when they're a little bit older they start to eat meat 
and the meat is chewed up and spit out by other adult wolves in the pack. A little bit of wolf baby food. Nursing on the cliff, little lamb gets tucked in close, nighttime falling fast. These are Barbary sheep, also known as weadads, and both the females and the males have horns like that. They're made of keratin, which is the same substance our fingernails are made from. I really hope you liked my book, Baby's Bond. And if you enjoyed the fun facts I was telling you throughout the book, you might want to check out the back pages where there's even more information that you can learn about each of the animals pictured in the book. Please make sure you subscribe to this channel and I'll see you soon. Don't forget to try writing a haiku. Bye-bye.